you look at any screenshot of Brink, you know it's Brink. It can't be mistaken for anything else. When we first started talking about this game, we did kind of have this vision of a super photorealistic game. Well, everyone's done the realistic thing. We didn't want to do this, something that's done a thousand times before. It wasn't until Olivier sort of came on board where we actually came along with the ultra-realistic, sort of exaggerated toon style. Olivier and I argued about that stuff for a while. Olivier had this vision for the artistic style of the game, the characters, the environments, and he's stuck with it. They were a bit cautious at the beginning. We are navigating between realism and sometimes a bit more cartoony. Any sort of detail would be oversized. Because of this really fast-paced action and combat game, you have to quickly identify who's in front of your gun. So having this kind of exaggerated style makes things easier for everybody. Yes. The facial animation, that's something that is quite difficult to achieve. If you remove just a little bit of expression on an eyebrow, you have a very different result. So for the animations, we've been using a type of motion capture, but where you capture at the same time the voice of the actor, the body motion, and the, the facial expression of, of the actor. So that was our approach to come up with something a bit different, not just realistic. The environment is just absolutely kick-ass. For the Founders Tower, we used a clean, white architecture style. And the aesthetic for the airport was inspired by Santiago Calatrava to keep it sort of sterile and clean. As you head further south to the areas where refugees are arriving, you enter more shantytown-like features, clearly inspired by favelas from Rio de Janeiro. Everything is working now. It looks great, so yeah, I'm proud of what we've been doing. It's a wash with colors. It's a wash with vibrancy. It's a lived-in world that you can just you know, reach into the screen and feel like you understand it, like you're living there yourself. It's absolutely perfect. In fact, right now, Olivier has a huge piece of paper on the back of his screen. We proved that the site was working. Color is back in shooter games.